Hey everyone, this is Miss Scarlet Tanager and I am here with a new Let's Play. We're going to play some Clock Tower 3. It was a decision between this, Fatal Frame, and Silent Hill 3, but I decided on this one because I've been playing a lot of the Clock Tower games lately, so let's get started. The first option, we got to make sure all the options are correct, because I haven't done that yet. Mostly because I just remembered it. Off! I know you guys hate me for that, but I can't stand it. I can't stand it! That's why I tried to be quiet during the cutscenes when the characters are talking. New game! Loading. This game's actually pretty good with load times from what I remember. It kind of feels like Haunting Ground, where you're being chased, and you gotta hide. But... Dearest Alyssa, how have you been? How have you been? I think of you every day. It seems such a long time since you started your life at boarding school. It was after your beloved grandfather went missing while missing. traveling three years ago that I sent you away to boarding school and told you not to come back for at least six at years. At least six years? Without giving you any explanation. It must have been very painful for you, and I'm sorry, but it was for your own protection. Now, your 15th birthday is approaching, and I fear your life may be in danger more than Probably. ever before. Please, go into hiding until your 15th birthday has passed. I know that what I am saying will make no sense to you, but please, do as I tell you and hide as quickly as you can. Your loving mother, Nancy. Mum. Alyssa, you're wanted on the telephone. It's your mother. No, it's not. Trip! It's a trip! Hello? Mum? Hello? Are you there? What's wrong? Answer me. Hello? Hello? Mum? Hello? Mum? After the first, like, five times, you think. And she runs right home doing exactly what her mom told her not to do. Smart one, this. Mum? I'm back. I'm home. Even though you told me not to. Mom? <laughs> ah! Giant jump scare music! For a door opening into the light! <laughs> she should have stayed at school. Again, smart girl, this. Oh, hi, dear. You're a creeper. Um, excuse me. Are you one of the lodgers? Yes, I am. Oh, I'm Alyssa, Nancy's daughter. Um, do you know where my mother is? Your mother has gone out. Gone out. It was early yesterday morning. Huh? She mentioned that she would not be coming back for some time. What? She was wrong. She won't be coming back at all. You killed her! And it's just you. You are all alone in this world now, little girl. <laughs> My sweet Alyssa. I've been waiting so long for this moment. Catafile! Dude, she's like 14. <laughs> Well, turning 15. So, our mom's missing, we're about to turn 15, which apparently is important, and there's a pedophile in the house. This is a bad thing. Also, I have played this game before. It's been a little while, but I have played it before. Are clocks still save points? Yes, they are, I think. Maybe. Maybe they're save points, I can't remember. <coughs> Because I think that's something that carried over into Haunted Ground, is that they're save points. Or maybe it's just the books. Yep, it's the books. Let's make sure we got enough place to save. Ah, hey, look, it's my old save file. Saving over that. Click, 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 click. Oh, okay. Fine, be that way. So let's go follow the creeper. Okay? Sounds like a good idea, right? 
It's not, by the way. It's it's totally not. Hey, look! It's a thingy, my bob. I wonder what happens if I touch it. Ow! That was very painful. You're kind of a jerk face. And tutorial time. We've got a panic meter. Whenever Alyssa is feeling physically or emotionally threatened, the panic meter rises. When the panic meter reaches max, she, Alyssa falls into a state of panic. That's the only time, well, one of the only times you can really be killed is when you're in a state of panic. While in a state of panic, Alyssa's movements are restricted, and if attacked while in a state of panic, she will die. Yep. We'll go down slowly if Alyssa realizes the place. The panic meter is important, <coughs> is what it's saying. Gasp! Fire! Fire goes away! And there's a hole! So now let's crawl over the probably still smoking and burning and going to put three degree birds on our legs. Cinders. How do I do this again? Okay, that button. Circle is the crouch and crawl button. Oh dear, it's a secret place. I wonder what's here. Oh, it's a statue. That's crying blood. <laughs> ah, so spooky! So spooky! We got a sacred bottle. That's very important. It has holy water, and holy water is good. Nancy's letter. <coughs> Dearest Alyssa, I wanted nothing more than for you to live peacefully, but if you're reading this now, you must have come back to the house. For your protection, I am giving you some advice, as well as instructions on how to use this bottle of holy water. Holy water uses exorcism. If you are ever threatened, sprinkle some holy water on your assailant. It will cause them to halt temporarily. Destroying sigils. To break the seals that prevent access to certain places, sprinkle holy water on them. Plenishing holy water. Always remember that you that the holy water you have is not in limited supply. You can refill your bottle either from sacred jars or lying drinking fountains. Sentimental items and spirits. A person who has died of unnatural causes has unfinished business in this world. In order to protect yourself, you must heal their wounds. To do so, you must find the sentimental item. Lastly, this is all my fault. I will do my best to protect you. Please, remember that I love you more than anything else in the world. And I always will. Mom. Aww. Mom did something and apparently we're paying the price for it. Well, kind of, but not really. It, it, it's comp- it's complicated. Just a little complicated. I'm crawling! I'm solid Alyssa. Not as good as Bates. Okay, get up, honey. Do, 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 do. Oh god, I got shards of glass in my eye! <coughs> Cause that's how that works, right? What's this? This place is clean. I didn't do it. That's probably my mom getting killed. I can't go over there yet, though, because even though the sigil is drawn on, it hasn't actually become a sigil, because it's not glowy and stuff. I must have left the wardrobe open. Nothing here. Nothing here. Clock is stopped. I need winding keys. Something, something. Something. I thought there was something here. Oh, well. Let's pick up the glowy thing. I wish I had one too. That is an old as hell computer. Oh, it's a picture of, of mommy and grandpa and little me. Aww. I find it funny that they reuse names. This character's name is Alyssa. In the previous game, the main character's name was Alyssa. Go back to school. 
Go into a hiding for a few days. Mum, I came back home. You're a dumbass. I know you told me not to, but I couldn't help it. I'm so worried about you. Where are you, Mum? A book! Gasp. <coughs> this music is so generic. I think I've heard it in like seven different games. Oh, it's that guy I saw! Oh no! <laughs> Time to freak the fuck out! Ermagerd! Where's it coming from? Ermagerd! Who's playing that? Where's the sound Probably from the piano downstairs. I think you have one. Who's doing that? Walk into the light! Cause I'm smart. SMRT. Except not. Seriously, she opens the door, sees all this light, goes, oh no, let's run it to the light. And where have I come out at? A place. It's a very cutscene game to start off with. Less so later, but. That's right, guys! The Blitzkrieg in England! I think this is the World War II? Bombing of London? Or bombing of the UK or something? Those fire effects, man! Those fire effects. <laughs> and of course, there's just music playing. Just don't even don't even worry about it, Brusty. And everything's on fire. Anything done here? Nope? Okay then. I think there are ghosty goos. I didn't do it. Somebody's holding the door closed. Well, somebody got trampled or probably exploded and eviscerated by a pack of rabid bunnies. And he's missing his wedding ring. Go see! The ghosties will hurt you unless you appease them and ease their souls. Hi, ghostie! Yep. The ring, give me back my ring. Some of them are non-hostile, some of them are absolutely hostile until you fix their everything. Engagement ring! Yeah, 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 I've played this game before. Spiritual healing. How about the ghosty goo? By using the ring. Um, use it. And now the ghost can live peacefully! Yay! I didn't get me a thing. Sigil stone. I think that brings me back to life if I die. Kind of like the stone mirror in Fatal Frame. Drinking fountain. Refill. Also, might as well save. Because I don't think this game has, a, uh, has an autosave function. So we're going to save like you stole something. Jum, 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 jum. Seven minutes? I've not been playing this game for seven minutes. Not according to my timer. This must be another cutscenes don't count game. <coughs> I can hear a piano. That is a 
loud as hell piano. Like seriously loud. And shards in the eyeballs. No. Okay. Back to some water. I'm going to try and keep my water tip top shape as much as I possibly can. That's actually really good piano playing. Anything down here? Ah, there's something down here. No, get off me! See, see, they attack you. They totally attack you. Give me this. I got a fountain pen. That's important. Kind of. <laughs> it's another special item that we have to give to a ghostie. For in particular, I think we have to give it to this ghostie. That's after me. I have to give you your uh, thing back. Yes, I have to give you your thing. And now you're all happy again. No, what are you gonna give me? An invisibility band. I think that turns me invisible for a bit. If I remember correctly, like 30 seconds. Or... Not very long, but long enough that you can sneak past stuff if you need to. Yeah, we can't even go over to the concert hall yet. It's totally locked. Not too much point in trying, I don't think, unless it's this one that's locked. Nope, it's not locked, okay. Yeah, we have to go through here first. And everything is borked. Lavender water! What lavender water does is it calms us down. We can use it to um, rapidly calm ourselves down. Also, hide spot. Just like in Haunting Ground and everything else. Paper. Dad's letter. <clears throat> Dear May, how are you? I am now in France, in an area known as Copenhagen. Or Champagne. Copenhagen, that's Denmark. It is a beautiful place, with vineyards as far as the eye can see. When the war is over, we must come here together for a holiday. I hear that they have organized, they have organized for blackouts in London now. I am sure you are fine during this during the day, as Jane is there, but I worry about you being alone at night. You'll be all right, won't you, darling? Keep warm. With love, Daddy. No, They're both dead. <laughs> That's just how these games work. It's like, oh, with love from Daddy, and everybody's dead. Step, 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 step. I don't want to go over there. I don't want to go over there yet. I'm gonna go over here slightly less. Because I think I know what happens. I think that particular room triggers the stalker. This game is starting to slowly come back to me, and I think that's what triggers the stalker, and the stalker is bad. So we're gonna do everything we possibly can before triggering that guy. Including searching everything. Nothing. This record is quite old. There's a poker. Someone must have just been here. And a thingy. Where's that key? The red drawer key. So we need to find a drawer that's red so we can use the red drawer key on it. How do I know that that key is specifically for something with a red I see something with a red- I see something red down there. I think this means I need to go past the guy that I don't want to go past. Do it. Okay, here we go. Mah. See, see, red drawer, right there. <coughs> Christmas tragedy: young pianist brutally murdered. Christmas Day, nineteen forty-two. Aha! It was World War Two. Paul Mall. May Norton, age 12, was found murdered in the Norton in Norton's The Tailor. 
She was discovered by Norton family nanny, Jane Stride, who returned home to find the victim unconscious, bleeding from the head. And unconscious? So she could have survived? An autopsy has revealed that it was an instantaneous death. Oh, no, she, she was dead, not unconscious. <laughs> Caused by a bl blow to the skull, that's not a skull, skull, with a heavy blunt object. No sub suspects have been named. The victim had taken part in the 15th Annual Piano con Concourse in the Victoria Hall in Kensington on the previous day. A consummate pianist, Miss Norton was widely tipped for first prize, but an unfortunate error in her performance prevented her from taking the crown. May have been living at home alone since her father, William Norton, is serving officer, returned to the front in July. Aww. Too much pressure on a 12-year-old. Yep, here we go. Stalker time. He's got a hammer. He's just tearing over there, that sick bastard. Go help, Alyssa, go help! Ow. No, it was Billy. Of course you killed her. We saw you do so. Okay, time to from the stalker. Alisa. So. Alisa. Yeah, 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 another blues game. Can I use the red jerky? Yes, I will. Maze room key. No, getting out. Falls, not gonna work. <laughs> Stay with me. Stay with my face. Stay with my face. My face. Stay away from it. I don't like you because you're creeping. You've got a hammer, and I'm allergic to hammers. Hi! Wait, what? So he just won't come into this room? There is a diary. May's diary. December, 5th December. Today I, today I darn daddy's socks into the button on his shirt. He calls himself a tailor, but he can't even mend his own clothes. Please, daddy, I'm not your wife. Okay. 15th December. Only a few more days until the concourse and I still can't play perfectly. What am I to do? I know Daddy's with me well and far away, so I must try my very best. Don't worry, Daddy. I'll make you proud. Apparently you failed, so... Yeah. What's this? An invitation to the piano concourse. Something bad's gonna happen. Son of a monkey! What do you what do you want? The escape has been blocked. What do I do? Grab this! Grab the obvious glowing thing, of course. It's been 25 minutes, I need to stop this video. Alice! <laughs> oh. And that's gonna be it for this video, guys. My name is Miss Gratitude and I have been playing Sick Lock Tower 3. See you all!